Welcome to my custom interloper run. I'm Nifo29, and here's what's in our backpack. We're underweight. We have lots of fire strikers. We have a book. How much time was left on this? Two hours. Okay. Uh, we're all good there. Still have 11 uh, birch bark. We could do with a repair on the snow pants. There we go. Uh, we got a little bit of food. We got some water. Um, Bo is down to 36. And we have four more arrowheads. And we have the supplies to make a bow. Uh, we're on day 72. Here's our skills. Harvesting and cooking are both at five. Mending's getting close to four. And we are mid-morning. Okay, we're going to leave these here. Let's just go. Oh boy, look at the... Look at the fog. So, before we just run off and go and repair the tower, we need more ammo. We have eight arrows. We're not going into bleak with eight arrows. We gotta make more. Um, we're probably gonna make a bow as well. Take these feathers. Uh, maybe we get lucky and we'll find that other deer. We'll see. Uh, there's a good chance we're not going to repair the tower today. We have to get sorted out first. Which means crafting more arrowheads. Uh... I don't know. We might not even stay here. We might actually leave before repairing the tower. Oh, there's the barn. Um, we do have some, uh, where are they? Is that it? Arrow shot. We all, uh, you know what? Maybe we don't need to leave. Maybe we don't need to leave. What do we want? Well, for starters, we want the pry bar. That's scrap metal. Actually, that would be right there. Harvest you. I think I want to harvest that... Uh... Where are you at? You're at night. You're the good one. Okay. I think I want to harvest this. That's an hour and a half. We get four. Oh, look at that. We're actually gaining temperature. That is good. All right. We have 13. We're going to leave five. It gives us eight. Get a fire going. So if I remember correctly, you get two arrowheads per piece of scrap metal. So that'll be 16, piece, uh, 16 arrowheads. That should be more than enough for now. We don't need to make 700 of them right oh, at yeah. once. That's a good one. Uh, there's eight pieces. And we'll just wait for that. Uh, now, do we have a heavy hammer on us? We don't. Oh, we can't even make arrows here. I'll take that. We can't make arrows here. Not without a red toolkit. 
But we will have to leave. We'll do that. Um, yeah. You up to... Go hide in here. Arrowheads. Need to make 1,329 arrows because reasons. <laughs> yeah. That's a little much. Although, could you imagine? I mean, early game. I mean, maybe some of you do it. But just gathering scrap metal and just making like 100 arrowheads right from the get-go. Um, I think we're going to need to drink. I'll check the fire. I think the fire is fine. Yeah, we got six hours on that. Uh, we want the dog food. And we'll leave the can behind. We may as well eat the other one. That peanut butter is going to come in handy. Alright, um, go like this. Whoa, that was kind of funky there. You can go there. Come on. There you go. We'll hide back in the corner. The most you made for arrowheads was 200. There we go, two hours. Usually make between 50 and 100, keep 20 on you and place the rest about. Yeah, I think I think the most I've ever made was like 30-ish. It wasn't outrageous. All right. We need to take you. We're going to take that. Is there anything in there? No. Um, you're a heavy hammer. I have the heavy hammer on me. I have, there's a hacksaw. I'm going to take, we're going to go back. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. To like Mystery Lake. We have three. Yeah. We're going to go back to Mystery Lake. Because like I said, we're not making arrows without a red tool kit. And we don't have a red tool kit out here. So it's nighttime, I know, but look at our alertness, right? I will not make the mistake of going to bleak a second time without having enough ammo. Uh, I guess we'll go around this. We don't have any meat on us either. It is all gone. Um, the one thing that we can do when we're in Mystery Lake, we can also, uh, uh, and th I should actually point out, the reason I want to go to Mystery Lake is to get rid of this bow. Uh, we can drop... sounded closer than I would like. Um, I want to get rid of the bow, which I think I'm going to just throw it at the uh, camp office as a collectible. And there's a red tool kit there. Uh, we can probably make another bow there. Oh, great. I don't want to fight. I'm surprised there's a wolf. Uh, I guess this is where we go up.
I'd definitely rather do this during the daytime, but I mean, what are you going to do, right? How many arrowheads do we have now? We have 20. That's actually a good amount. We might need to, I think, what do we have? 15, uh... Where are they? Right there, 15 arrow shafts. So maybe at the camp office there's a couple of birch saplings. Maybe. Um... I just, I, I might actually just make as many arrows as we can. I think that wolf gave up. That's good. But there's one right there. Oh, dang. Initially, I when I first saw him, I saw him a few seconds before I looked over. I thought he was actually a rabbit. I think this bear is going to be the, the biggest problem for us. Now, can we cross over? I don't want to. That's one large noisy rabbit. I think he was partially behind a hill and I think I just saw his head at first or something. The very first time I saw him. That's why I didn't really say anything because I figured it was a rabbit and like who really cares, right? This way. I think I say this every time I'm walking this way, but man, it's a lot farther than you think. the snow shelter you want to be part of the pack <laughs> all right I need to save my sprint I figured that was a bad way, place to start running. I think he left. I think he's leaving. Do we have any rocks? No, we don't. I might pull out, not that, this. Uh, let's go around this way. No, they can't path over the thin ice, but I don't know if there's any part of that ice that's not thin. How many sticks did we gather? 
We only have four. That's fine. Now, I have to remember, the camp office isn't actually our base. It's, uh... The trapper's cabin. Put you away. There might be some feathers here. Uh, I'm just gonna click on you. Nope. Okay. I'm trying to remember. I think... I think a wolf may have ran off with one of our arrows. I can't remember. Actually, I think I remember the one, that, the one I'm thinking about is the one that I ended up getting later. You're a wolf. Whatever, I'm gonna click on him anyway, just to see, okay. I'd rather make sure that I'm not leaving an arrow in one of them. Hmm. I'll be happy to know that today's word of the day is easier than yesterday. Good. Yesterday sucked. <laughs> Yeah, the camp office is just for displaying stuff, so we will have to go there to get rid of this bow. And then maybe we'll head over to uh, the trapper's cabin in the morning. And we'll craft our bow over there. And hopefully uh, one or both of those locations will have birch saplings. The word of the day is mendacious. And what does that mean? Telling lies, especially habitually dishonest, lying, untruthful. Nice. Ah, uh, it's not the long dark if the wind's not blowing in your face when you're trying to get somewhere, is it? How stiff is this wind? Minus 19, of course. Wow, it's even windy inside the tunnel. I'm not sure I can carry much more. But on this side of the tunnel, it's not windy. Well, it's still windy, it's just not affecting our walk speed. Uh, when I get past this tree, I'm just I'm gonna run. We're uh A little bit past our bedtime here. Um, we woke up. To start the stream, we woke up. We didn't have full uh, alertness. Which is why we started a little bit later in the day than I would normally like. Yeah, camp office and then the trapper's cabin is where we're going. That way the bow is just dealt with. If I if I go to the trapper's cabin, I'm gonna forget to get rid of the bow or I'm gonna change my mind and say, ah, I don't need to do it. So if I go to the camp office, I can get rid of the bow, it's done. And there might be saplings there that we can grab. And then we can take those over to the, the trapper's cabin. Turn them saplings into uh, arrow shafts, and we we definitely need to make a bow. 
I know it seems stupid, like, hey, you have like a 100% bow variant. Why don't you just use that? I don't want to. That's why. Plain and simple. I like the bow variants, but I prefer them for collecting. I don't really think. Freezing. Um, I mean, I know they last longer and such, right? I don't know that the wood rights last longer, but the the sport bow, I believe. No, no, no. The wood rights last longer. The sport bow, I don't think it does. But the reduced sway and everything, I don't know that when you're archery five, I don't know that that matters a whole lot. So I just like to keep them as little souvenirs. Obviously I'll use one in desperation, but we're not in desperate times. Now is there any cooked meat or are we relying purely on peanut butter? I think there was some food inside. This is probably all raw. Yes. We got ptarmigan, but you know us, we can't see them. Okay, let's just go inside. This pack is getting kind of heavy. Uh, you're only a maple. Well, we'll move you over to the camp office anyways. There's nothing over here. Um, I thought I was already in this tab. I guess you can just go up there. All right, there's nothing anywhere. Except for that there flask. Alright. Well. Uh, peanut butter and possibly cattails. No, we're not going to touch the cattails. I don't like doing that. You use one of the sport bows and then you just use the regular bows. Yeah, with two sport bows, I guess, I mean, you could use one of them and not really care. I mean, honestly, it doesn't matter even if it's, if it's, you know, ruined. It's not like it disappears, right? You can still just toss it on the ground and display it visually. I don't think it looks any different than when it was brand new. That's that, okay. How soon we forget. <laughs> Drink some water. I'm pretty sure there's food. That's why I'm not eating the cattails. If we get to the trapper's cabin, there's no food, we'll eat cattails. But I believe there is meat outside. There is... Um... I believe there's some guts and there's, I believe there is saplings. This could actually work out well for us. If this dough keeps running ahead. Good girl. That's exactly where I want her running to. I would love if she ran that way again. I'm not going to shoot her, but... Okay, well, she's done. Just kind of figured... Use her as a decoy, right? 
for as long as we can. two seconds ago. Oops. And just keep going. No time to mess with the wolves. seems that this little dip might be a better place to go up. Go here. There's Mr. Bear. It's a goddamn freezing. All right, let's run. Try and save some of our condition. I saw it. I had to. All right, and that extra hacksaw, I do believe I remember I took it. It's going to get left here. there. Put you away. Watch, this meat won't be cooked. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. We'll take the venison. Birch. Uh, I guess we will drop that. Why was that one way over there? It's not supposed to be. Are you going to show up in here? No. Throw you in there, and we can get rid of four stems. There we go. Uh, what do we got for water? Okay, uh, we got to pick those up so we can throw them back down. throw you right in there uh, no other stuff in there no okay uh, we'll drop that one <laughs> merge parent I'll throw you way up there how are these knives 39 is no good 79 is not bad 80 Ours is 68. We will take you. 
Uh, we do have a little bit of other food. Speaking of, I should eat this. And we do have water, so that's good. Hey, look at that. Um, drink that. I'm going to take you now. Let's just look in here. Look at all the fire strikers. Okay, you know what? We'll keep the two best is what we'll do. We'll do that. Now we only have what we need. Uh, that would be better out there, wouldn't it? Well, let's get to what we're going to do. Arrows. I may not make arrow shafts. How many can we make? 10? Yeah, I don't think we'll make any. I think we'll just go with what we have. Oh, wow, we're thirsty. We're pretty hungry too, but I want to make arrows until it says no more. So it's too dark. All right, now how many can we still make? We can still make three, which is two and a half hours. All right. Well, I guess let's drop the birch. Um, we have eight. You know what? Let me look how many I know this is the bad way of doing it. That's not what I wanted 20 Probably good We need food though Ooh, hello Tis an Aurora Um, you know what I want to do? I want to drop that heavy hammer before I forget. I just saw it. And I do not want to walk all the way back there and find that I still have it. Because that would suck. Uh, is there anything else aside? We need that for the time being. Let's throw you guys there. Um, you're maple. You're two birch. Yeah, I remember you guys. Okay. It's bedtime. All oh, right, the gun cleaning kit. We'll get rid of that in the morning. up and drink up and you can go in there um well, we're, we're going to find a blue flare in the, uh, in the cave. We have two and two. 
We can leave those two. Because we have you and we have you. Yeah. Now, I know it's too dark, but I'm trying anyways, because sometimes weird things happen. Um, there's literally nothing we can do. Aside from just passing time. Well, there's that. We can prepare the burdock. And that's it. All right. We don't want a book. We want the bed. Where's the bed? Let's do that. There we go. Right, there's those. Uh, we need arrow shafts. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make more arrows. Like I'm going to make as many arrows that we can with the, with the, uh, the arrowheads and the couple of extra arrow shafts. I'm just going to keep them on us. Oh, wow. I guess we might have just one extra arrow shaft. I might make another. Another sapling because yeah, that does not. This way we can. There we go. This way when arrows break, we have a shaft on us after we break it down. You go there, you go there. Uh, we need to eat. We need food. And unfortunately, that's the last of the bear meat. And the water. Uh... All right, what's the bow? Oh, I want to make those two, but not right now. Uh, five hours. Well, we can uh, go an hour at a time, I guess, on the bow. I don't really, I, I really don't like boiling water while I'm trying to do something. Come on, little fire. I find it's kind of a pain in the butt because none of the times add up. Like it's an hour 24 to boil the water. You know, maybe if I was smart, I would have. Well, we can do one and a half. Let's do that. Actually, that works. Do that. Uh, this will work until it tells us no and stops giving us that 0.5. Wow. Actually, yeah, this is working out all right. I'm just going to put, I'm going to do that 
Yeah, there we go. We got two hours, so hopefully that was exactly enough time for the, the water. And we have a bow. 100%. Can't see. If I can't see, you can't see. Perfect. All right, we'll leave. Uh, let's eat you. Drink you. And we'll leave some water here. Good. Uh, can we get an hour on this book? What was our... Okay. Well, can we get an hour on this? Will it... No. Too dark to read. Well... I'll just sleep. So it says no more sleep. And that's not horrible, I guess. time there we go and we have a blizzard so we can probably get a couple hours of reading drop the book there we go fire starting what did that do for you uh -oh, did a little really don't want those books. Um, I'm going to have to take that wood. That wood, that food. <laughs> Change one letter and all of a sudden it's a whole different item. 88, let's repair you. We're in morning now, we can go. 89, we'll get you. Ninety. Okay. Now what's all in here? We have five of those. I'm probably gonna take that scrap metal. I'm gonna keep this bow. Uh, some people may not like that, but anything else we need? That's scrap metal as well. Uh, the plan with that stuff is to leave it. Let's eat you. Leave it over at the at the forge. I mean, it's no good to us anywhere. Although, actually, you know what? It is actually good to us because... We have to go and here we need four scrap metal all right we'll leave one and there's two yeah fill you up Get you in here. Let's go. All 
Alright. I have all the supplies to repair the tower. Wow. We have all the supplies to repair the tower. Please don't tell me I went there already and left the supplies to repair the tower. I already forget whether I did that or not. Because if I did, that's means we're just carrying dead weight. Oh, yeah. Look at that's with 28 arrows. And a brand spanking new bow. Well, I think we have enough arrowheads. Provided we don't lose arrows, right? Is that birch bark? <laughs> I'm one arrow away from perfection. Does it eat you up not having 29 arrows? Actually, 30 would be perfect because then when I pull out my bow, it'll tell us we have 29 down on the bottom corner. Hey, puppy chat. Welcome in. Here, you want coffee time? Okay. <sighs> there we go. Thanks for that. Oh, there's another one over there. That's good. That's good. That means we are back to having an even number. Now, the question is, do we have enough time? Do we have enough time to get there, repair the tower, and get to bleak? I guess we're going to find out, right? And remember, when we go to Bleak, we're there strictly to repair the tower. We're not formally going to Bleak. When we go to Bleak, we'll be going in the proper way. Through a uh, ravine so we can get the, the key for the... The workshop. So this doesn't officially count as going to Bleak. Yeah, it shows you, like, down right there, it's 28, and now it's 27, because now there's one in the bow. So, uh, it's, it's questionable. Do I prefer to have 29 arrows? So we can quickly have a glimpse of the 29? Or do I prefer to have 30, so that when I pull it out, there's 29 displayed on the screen for a while? That's the real question. Either way, I'm just happy I got, you know, more than eight. We got a good amount. I don't think I'm that picky on the arrows. The cattails are something a little different. I don't see that 30 cattails is going to save our life over having 29. I don't think you can have 29 cattails and be like, oh, man. We're going to lose our run because we didn't take that one other cattail. Alright, we got to remember. Might be some puppies down here. I do want sticks because uh, 
There's a good chance we might have to have a fire and just sit there and twiddle our thumbs. Phew. <laughs> I couldn't remember if I grabbed my pots. Let's put you away. We're not paranoid. Hey, Eddie. Welcome in. Mer, do not do a stretch today. I owe, er, I owe Eddie a stretch from yesterday. So here, let's do it right here. There we go. There we go. Stretches on cooldown. <laughs> Somebody was here once. You know what we're not doing this time? We're not like skirting around the edges yesterday. That was so sketchy. I think we were like one second away from going in. We will stick to out here. I wonder... I, I, we don't really have the time. I don't want to go into bleak with uh, scent either. I'm trying to remember the time we went to Bleak unprepared and why we encountered the Timberwolves. Did I have a bunch of meat on me? Is that the reason? Like aside from being unprepared, was I just, what is, oh, that's just a footstep, right? Yeah, that's a footstep. Every once in a while you see a footstep, like a footprint. And you think like, it looks like either a feather or it might be an arrow or something. No harm in checking. a big fat juicy buck up ahead we actually have two of them but we don't have time to deal with that because we have to repair the tower is it this one? Oh, we have a oh hey 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 all right there's three of you you're you're going down right now we may not have time to take them out and do our thing now. Oh, he's turned. That, there we go. But we can always kill the wolf. Now when we come back from Bleak, we'll have some meat. Oh dude, you're just tempting me. <laughs> you don't remember if I had a bunch of scent on me, you just know that it was a bad idea that someone suggested to me. Yes. If only we could remember who that was. If there was a way to go back in time, whoever could it have been? And it said, hey, you're unarmed. You should go to Bleak. Repair the tower. Go to Bleak. I think I re already repaired the tower, didn't I? I think that's how that worked. I think that's how that played out. I repaired the tower. This is before I started doing it properly. I repaired the tower. I was leaving. 
And then it was suggested by someone. Luckily, that person never comes around anymore because, whoa, would I yell at them, eh? <laughs> I'm kidding. Yeah, and then he's made the... And then, yeah. And of all things, I mean, I just made it dumber and dumber, right? Like, ooh, I should drop some weight. I don't need this blue flare. <laughs> no ammo. What did I have? Three arrows? And then I dropped my blue flare. To save weight. Alright, I am happy that I haven't been up here. That was Mountain Town where I dropped everything in the box. That's where it was. This pack is getting too heavy to carry. That's how it should always be. Just put the damn battery in the box. to do that with my left hand on my mouse because I had my coffee in my right hand. That was awkward. You know what they could use those flare uh those those fuses for? They could use the fuses as kind of a weight on your fishing line. And if you do that, obviously your hook's gonna go down to the bottom and maybe that's where you have a better chance at catching the big ones. There's an idea. I like my idea. They should do that. Right. What's over here? We got some wood for the, the weight. We have a deer. We're not obviously going to touch him. We're going to take the... Is that a sapling right above us? It would be. Alright. Let's go check the, the plane crash. Yeah, we should do that. Make a little list of people that give me stupid ideas that that go against the idea I already had. Who's and and they've changed my mind. We should totally do that. That's a great idea, Murd. <laughs> Ooh, it's a helicopter. Wait, isn't it always a helicopter? <laughs> Oh, we can get in there. Is there actually going to be anything in here, though? Yes, it's always a helicopter. Oh, great. That means we're going to have 400 compartments to check and find absolutely nothing. Oh, I can't get in there. Well, we have to go out this side so we can check. You and you, and maybe there's something up here. Hope nobody needs this anymore. Oh, didn't really want that. Let me out. There we go. <laughs> that it's actually pretty funny what you typed there, Eddie. If only you knew. <laughs> if only you knew. 
Murd, Murd knows what I'm talking about, but I'm not going to, uh, I won't say it. If you join the discord, I might tell you in there why, what you typed. Why not turn left and go down? Cause Murd wants his name on the list a second time. And this is where you scream. That's not where you go. <laughs> oh, why did I listen to you? Why? Why? Okay. Well, we made it. We're good. <laughs> not there down the snowbank. <laughs> Is there a different spot that's way better? Way more suitable for that? I took the worst spot. I'm an idiot. Well, it worked out. <laughs> the, the first look that I had there was like, oh no. There's a little bit of a lip on this and that's going to drop us and we're going to ruin everything and All right. Everything worked out though. Where's Darth? Let's summon Darth. What do we have now? We have 28. Well, it's just after midday, so... Oh, hello. Thanks for having nothing. I gave you a mini heart attack. <laughs> so I guess I would come down there? I don't know. You know what? We're going to need something to do when we're there. keep grabbing sticks oh you know what I need I need some old man's beard because we used one of our bandages so we don't have two full sets I hope that's just oh that's apparently not just a deer <laughs> all right let's just go let's go After we grab these. <laughs> Alright. Do you think I'll get a piece? This is the dirtiest troll ever. Let's go. I'm going to grab all the sticks and hopefully not get lost because that is embarrassing. I guess I don't need to drop one. I can just 
replace one. I'm going right. Perfect. One thing I love in these caves is dead ends. We don't need to leave you behind. This is one of those caves that I think I get lost a lot in as well. Oh, right, because I always forget to climb. Right here. Yeah, that's Hinterland's troll to us, that coal right at the opening there. The thing is, you used to be able to get some of it though, right? Like, I don't know that you can actually... Oh. Okay. There's that, and there's this. I don't know that you can actually get any of that coal anymore. I haven't been able to for a while. Put you right there. If spray painting didn't take as long, I might use the spray paint more. Oh, where do I want to go? Oh, great. We have a blizzard. Hey, am I out now? I don't, I don't know that this is where I came in. We'll find out. Well, oh, this isn't where we came in. But we're also not... I thought I had to go in and crawl. I thought I had to go through that crawl space. Uh, we want this. We want that. Do you up. do that yeah you used to be able to get some of the coal they added another spot where you can't get coal sometimes that spots a jerry can and it's underpassed by the large ceiling mine uh, we don't have a lot of food you know why I'm reluctant to eat that it's not because of the 29 it's because it's a desperate Desperate thing. Um, man, I'd rather not be in this cave. I'd rather be out there. I'm not sure I can carry it. Was, it was actually quite quiet. That's why I was checking. Thought maybe the. Maybe the blizzard had passed. Hey, OG. Welcome in, bud. How you doing? Do this. I think let's check. Uh, this blizzard's going to go right till nighttime. Do we have here? Uh, 
Uh, the reason I'm not eating the cattails and the reason I have so much of this wood is because I was hoping to get over by the bunker. And then we would just have a fire. But I wonder if the blizzard thing is Hinterland's way of, of preventing people from planning ahead. Making that you don't get there and just hang out. I mean, I guess it kind of looks bad. And this pack is getting kind of heavy. For the game, if you already know where the bunker is and you just go there and sit there waiting for it. There we go, we can go. Yeah, there's a chance of green timber wolves only we don't have any scent. Let's pull this out for anyone who hasn't seen this. I think by the time we get there, we won't need a fire. They can still be right next to the bunker. I've only ever had them that one time. Only that one time. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Which makes me believe that I think I must have had scent in that one. Grab three of these and we'll eat three of these. There we go. And Run. Okay, maybe don't run. I'm not going to grab more. I already grabbed enough. Alright. This is way cooler when the Aurora is actually powering the radio. Blue is for bunker. You had them here, and you don't travel with scent. Well, I've only encountered wildlife on our way to one of these bunkers that one single time. Every other time, it's been pretty, pretty safe. Did I miss the bunker? I know where it is. Or at least I think I know where it is. If I hear a howling, I will not be happy. Yes, I missed it. There it is. Ooh, sapling. Okay. 
All right. So let's just duck down. There we go. I know, I know. How many times have I been here before? Alright, here we go. Inside. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Bunker Alpha. We will just drink. And we can take the flashlight. I don't like the flashlight because if you miss on clicking on an item, you end up shutting the flashlight off and it just annoys me. But it does save the fuel. the book. Nothing up there. Do we see anything behind there? Man, all I can think about is food. Yeah, well, too bad you don't eat canned corn. Astrid doesn't like the canned corn. He'd rather drink her pee and Eat dog food. Man, this pack is getting kind of heavy. Play that funky music. All right. Yeah, I don't. I really. I, I prefer just using the lantern, but I mean, it it really does save your fuel. So. Remember when the toilets used to always have dirty water? I wonder why they changed that. <laughs> Be nice to Astrid. <laughs> hey, she's the one that says it. Not me. I call her a weirdo when she says that. Play the funky music. Uh, we don't care about a blue toolbox. Although you are scrap metal and we are going, you are scrap metal. Hey, Ask, Askat Valley. Belev, Askat Valley. Thank you for the follow. And thank you for stumping me with your name. <laughs> Alright, uh, I want to make sure there. Ooh, look at you. Alright, that's one of the the items we have to read. I'm just making good and sure that I'm not missing anything. That cloth. That's the other item. There's a bedroll because, you know, when you're prone to carrying too many duplicates grab a bedroll scrap metal we'll take that uh yeah let's uh here we go security chief's log 14. the mine is a real shithole if my job is to shepherd the men then their job is to keep the roof from landing on all of us but this week we found a decent chamber to start building Rudiger's gadget. Teams one and two are with the program, but on shaky ground. Team three is getting volatile again. And while it's unclear what they have planned, I've called for additional security to fly in immediately. 
The medical officer has been conducting alignment interviews and has made some troubling observations. I'm still considering the implications, both for the men as well as project viability. My hope is that the crew can keep their shit together long enough to finish phase one, and we can get out of this godforsaken place. It's starting to get to me. All right, there we go. Um, let's eat a little bit. We can drink, right? Uh, not really. Um, I do like to keep one of each of the food items. I don't know why. I really don't. All right, here we go. Let's make sure there's nothing else. Okay, transcript port. Session five, project medical officer interviewing patient seven. Let's visit the second instance again. First occurrence. What do you remember? Uh, the, sun, uh, the sun was out, but it was cold at the river's edge. There was a group of us that day. <laughs> Lots of laughing, yelling. Some were in our heads. <laughs> no one was getting in the water. I guess I liked being first. I didn't even jump, just <laughs> slipped in quietly away from everybody. Uh, the water was clear, but bitter cold. I thought the bottom was closer. My head went under right away. God, I was a lousy swimmer. Uh, no one noticed me struggling in the deep pool. Carry on from where you were last session. Find the ending sequence. What do you see? Oh, uh, my hand reaching for a flat gray stone at the water's edge. I, I grabbed it. I pulled my head out of the freezing water. <sighs> a breath. <laughs> the sun shining through the trees. Above us was... Was the sun out? I thought... Uh, the rain. No, 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 no. Uh, that, I don't know. That, that, that wasn't it. Keep hold of that image. It's okay if it fades a little. Breathe. Try going again. Second instance. All right, there we go. Sorry, I was just texting there. Uh, yeah, I guess we're going to have to eat a whole bunch of cattails. Um, and it's very, very, very late. Let's make sure there's nothing under here. Uh, as usual, we'll tear those down in the morning. Alright, how many? Maybe we'll go down to where, yeah. Around 20, I guess. There we go. Perfect. Will I get all of this soda down? I did. That's perfect. All right, 10 hours. And wake up in the middle of the day. do that we want the curtains oh you know what let's get rid of you right now I will peek 
Aha! Snow pants. That's why you take down the curtains. Um, I don't see anything in there. I, I, you know what? Anybody wants to take that down, I probably. Let's go. Let's do it. It's very easy to stick something inside between those ladder rungs there, so. Although they didn't, <laughs> but they could have. And then we'll just, we don't care about those flea smittens. They're no good. Uh, we got everything. Let's do that. You probably saw me do that while we were reading. Uh, yeah, let's just drink and we'll go. So is the airfield going to be next? Uh, well, it depends. I mean, it's got to be fairly soon, right? I mean, if we want to finish the signal void, because now we have to go, it is our next part of the story. Is that where y'all want to go or? Uh, it's obviously not going to happen in today's stream, but. Can we run? Good. Weather's looking nasty. Run. Wow. Running is barely running right now. Copper will love the walk and you like the airfield. <laughs> yeah, the, the pull, I guess, is the pull does want to bring us to the airfield. Jesus is cold. Shut up, Astrid. I'm not going to lie. I want to go to Sundered Pass. <laughs> We're not going to. Not until it's time, but... Man, I like that region. I don't know how much I like the zone of contamination though, to be honest. I'm not sure I can carry much more. It's got its cool features, but I don't know that I would put it in the upper half of my favorite maps. Just because of the gas, and if you go into the mine, then you gotta worry about uh, the gas. And then you got the rope climbs that kill your alertness, and it's just, eh. I really still, I, I really still wish that there, when you completed, you had a way of shutting the gas off, so that you could just go in there and just, just chill. Should I be going that way? Let's go this way and just get lost. 
I marked everything. But I don't see my markings. <laughs> You go back and forth with the zone of contamination. There we go. That's where we go. Sometimes you really like it. Sometimes you're like, eh. You know what? I, I, I think as a whole, I probably like it. But, and, and maybe now it would be different because I'm using that perk that eliminates cabin fever, right? So if I want to go hang out in the mine I don't have to worry about running back up to the cave every so often uh, the scarcity of food though wow that's that's a tough one right the gas constantly ruining your clothing yeah I think still my biggest complaint about the region is when you're outdoors um, and you do enter the gas it's it's not clear as to when you're in it and when you're out of it and I wish that would change I mean you can tell when you get in it though right because you have that sound alert but you don't really have a sound to say alright you're clear of it good and that bothers me um yes i am carrying the other bedroll um we're gonna go and try and get this deer oh man midday i don't want another blizzard i am tired of blizzards I didn't somehow accidentally we're on day 76 we've had 48 we've had blizzards half of the time more than half of the time I didn't inadvertently increase my blizzards did I That's where the recipes shine for the the cabin fever. Yeah, but if you just get the perk and use the perk, you don't need to worry about the recipes. All right, we gotta go this way. blizzard weather sometimes the long dark is like hey know what you need a blizzard <laughs> you know you want it oh for food okay right yeah you, you usually turn off cabin fever anyway for food inside the mine right right Making the MRE recipes. Which is the MRE one again? I remember you like the coastal fish cakes. And I don't remember the other ones. <laughs> Even though you've probably told us like 17 times. I build a fire right behind this tree. I'll do that. Oh, the wind I think has already shifted. It was coming straight and now it's right there. Come on, little fire. Come on. Can you just cancel? Is there a way of canceling it? Perfect. Now it's sideways. Now the wind block is over here. 
Or where actually is the wind buck? Wow, it just shifted. Yeah, it's way over here. Um, I'm going to make some mushrooms. I'm going to make some rose hips. And I'm going to think about whether or not I want to actually put any coal on this fire. The Briar House and Camber Flight Porridge is the ones you make a lot. Right, right, right. Uh, what do you think? It's, my, it's, uh, it's minus 17. I will throw one piece of coal oh and I can't get I can get to the wolf I don't want the wolf though I want the deer I'll do this just to get one piece of meat Thirty-nine minutes. Wow, we can get almost this whole deer. I mean, I could take the point nine. I may, uh, and just I'll just probably leave the guts. I can barely walk with this much gear. There we go. How's our fire doing? It's not blowing out yet. How are we doing though? Um, we'll do that. We'll drop all that. Uh, how long was this 29? Take that and we'll take the hide. I don't even know why I'm taking the hides. If we ever, I mean, we got enough of them already, but I guess. Okay. I am not, you know, I'm not forwarding one minute. So we got, what is the time? There we go. Now what can we do? You're an hour, right? An hour and a half. 75 do I what the heck this pack is getting too heavy to carry all right let's see eat you Drop those. What's the time? I think after these two, I'm just going to pick up the other ones. Let's just forward. And how much water do we have? 339. Um, we have two of you. Actually, you know what? Let's get one of those on there. I'll drink you. 
And we got everything. Let's go. Now we're going back. Uh, we're we're gonna get rid of that. Uh, maybe the saplings can go inside the bunker. I'm not gonna be able to carry this load for much longer. We're kind of done out here, I guess. Kinda, not entirely, but um. We have only the one memento cache. We don't have the deer pants cache yet. We still have to find that. And wouldn't you know, I forget where that one is. I remember where the cache is. I just forget where the actual note for the cache is. We'll find it. But, oh. Great. And we're on a hill. Where's those deer? Did they just disappear? You can't come this way. I would much rather have a deer take him out and then we take him out. It's just easier. It's not looking like that's going to happen though. He's not going to come around this side, is he? Where is he? Okay, he's still over there. These deer that were out here. Wow, look at... I wonder if you can just, like, get in there and call yourself safe. Astrid, squeeze your belly in. Oh, he's kind of stuck up there, I guess. He can't go the way we came, I guess. Interesting. Yeah, go check out the fire. Go warm up. It's not very cold. It's only minus one. Visually, it looks like it should be freezing, but I mean, it's not. It's not bad. Let's put you away. Three bars of scent. We got minus 17 wind, so any predators are probably coming in this direction. Maybe we get lucky and we can actually get that bear to show up by the time we get to our cabin. Whatever you want to call our little area there. Yeah, we're pretty heavy. That means none of this. <laughs> no running. Let 
It's the time. It's almost night time. Yeah, this region's not very good with the sled. I mean, I could probably use it. I think... Uh, I don't know. Oh no, that's what I was worried about. I was literally just thinking, you know, with the snap of your fingers, this could turn into a blizzard. I'd rather it didn't. But yeah, so with with all the the thin ice and the hills and the ridges and such, the sled doesn't work so great out here. And sometimes when it gets you to a spot where you can't proceed, it can kind of put you in danger. Because sometimes you can't even back up. You're just stuck right where you are. And everything has to come out. And if that happens when there's a wolf on your tail, that's not fun. Are we still at our full? No, we're not. I'm wondering if I might drink a coffee. I probably won't, but I, I actually am wondering if I should. <laughs> you know me. One day you will find my body out in the wilderness. And it'll have coffee. Is that a wolf? Yep. There be a wolf. Is that the same wolf now? Probably is, right? Well, you're way too close. Have we actually shot anything in this stream yet? Is that the first one I've taken out? Uh, aside from the one that took the deer out. I don't think we have faced anybody. I think I've just been running away from them. If you call this running. We have no feet. We can make footprints, but we can't see our feet. I love that. Awesome. All right, this is built for heavy people like us. I'm up here. should be over there this is the sapling that I kept seeing oh no now we have to walk all the way back there and all the way around there because we can't run and there's gotta be thin ice right there I'm not even gonna try it yeah this is a good region to not be heavy in I could just drop all the sticks, but you know, that's a lot of sticks, man. That's like 5.4. What is our weight coming from? It's the sticks, basically, and the arrows. Well... Uh, give me the 
of weight. Throw all of you. We'll throw you. We'll throw you. We're still above. Uh, I guess all the meat, right? I want to make sure I don't have meat. Uh, what the hell? Let's throw that in there, too. All right, we gotta, we gotta go. We gotta go. We're gonna have to probably at least one time pick everything back up, but I think where we're going, I think there's enough straight path that we can just be faster this way with the sled. Yeah, we're totally flying now. So if I remember correctly, like you can't get around that rock on the bottom there by the ice. You you have to go up. So I believe we will have to pick everything up because there's no way the sled's going up there. No chance. And I believe the reason you always come this way is because that is thin ice out there, so the sled wouldn't work there and we can't run without it, so... Well, we can't run with it either, but at least we can move at a pace that feels like we're running. Who knows? Maybe we get lucky. Maybe the sled does go up here. Oh. Look at us. Oh. That worked well. And now here. I wonder if we can get by on the left. The only downside of what we're doing right now is like I, I kind of really did want to be travel oh want to be traveling with the meat to see if that bear would be somewhere close by our camp. I guess if we're going to take him out, best to take him out in the daytime. Uh, I don't think we can go. I'm going to try and get back up this hill. Fun times. That's far enough, I guess. I can barely walk with this much gear. This was the other area. I mean, we got through the one area I didn't... What happened there? We got through the one area I didn't think we would get through. So... Not bad. Uh, we're gonna get back to this camp area and then we're gonna... I'm just gonna keep referring to it as a camp. Or the barn, I don't know. Because I always forget that it's more of a barn. But we're gonna get there. We're gonna drop all the all the wood and then we're going up the hill to the bunker 
Uh, the scrap metal will probably leave over here as well. But the saplings and the hides, or the hide, have to go over to the bunker so they can cure. This little area here, I really don't like this little area. If you have a wolf on your tail, this area is so, so bad. For the lumpy ground. do we have? I didn't even pay attention when we were grabbing them from the bunker how many I took. But we definitely have to warm up. Probably, uh, I don't want to do a, a warm drink either. Oh no. Is that going to do it? If we do use this, we're going to need eight pieces to get it to temperature. Let's take you. What is the temperature? It's 11. Will one more stick give us two arrows? There we go. Well, that wasn't very smart now, was it? Uh, 32 minutes. Okay, what I'm going to drop is the raw meat. And we'll drop cooked meat over here. Eat up. In 27 minutes. Oh, that was foolish. I, I was. Man. I was gonna break down the boots. Let's take you. Uh, scrap metal. You can go there. 
You can go there. You. Get rid of that. Yeah. Don't drink too much though. I want to leave room for a birch bark. And... Oh, I don't have a herbal tea made. We will need to make one. And we will need to drop that piece of meat again. I'll take that. And what else do I want to make? Let's make another herbal. Okay. Uh, let's break these boots. There we go. Uh, let's just go. You know what? I changed my mind. I'm going to get lost if I go up there. Five hours. I want to make good and sure this fire's going when we wake up. All right, that's good. Uh, food. Where is my food? Way over here. Eat that. How much do you give? You give five, and what is our bedroll giving us? 6.2. We'll use that. Alright. You're cold, you're cold, you're cold. Doesn't matter, I guess. We're gonna drink one of you, and we're gonna drink one of you. And we're gonna drink some water. And I think uh, we'll end this here. So for those of you on YouTube, if you like what you saw, please like and subscribe, and I will see you all tomorrow.